Are you ready to take a nostalgic trip back to the mid-1960s? Let's delve into the world of F Troop, a classic TV series that left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Out of the many roles in this TV series, which one was your favorite? What enduring qualities do you think make this TV series an everlasting symbol of the industry? Now, let's uncover some random facts about the show that may surprise you. F Troop was a Western-themed sitcom that aired from 1965 to 1967. Set in the fictional Fort Courage, it hilariously blended the Old West with slapstick humor and quirky characters. From the bumbling Captain Parmenter to the antics of the Hikawi tribe, it offered a unique take on the Western genre. Despite a relatively short run, F Troop has stood the test of time thanks to its timeless humor and memorable characters. The show's enduring qualities continue to make it a beloved symbol of the entertainment industry. Its ability to evoke laughter and capture the spirit of the era has left a lasting impression on audiences of all generations. Now, we're curious about your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this TV series. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Share your favorite moments or any anecdotes you may have about F Troop. It's a chance to connect with fellow fans and reminisce about this classic show. So, what's your favorite F Troop memory? Share it with us in the comments. F Troop, a beloved TV series that aired in 1965, was a classic Western comedy created by William T. Orr and first broadcast on ABC. Set in the post-Civil War era at Fort Courage, it followed the misadventures of the inept and eccentric soldiers of F Troop tasked with maintaining order on the frontier. The show featured a colorful ensemble of characters, including the bumbling Captain Wilton Parmenter, the scheming Sergeant Morgan O'Rourke, the beautiful but crafty Wrangler Jane, and the comically clueless Hikawi tribe. With slapstick humor, witty one-liners, and absurd situations, F Troop offered a unique blend of Western and screwball comedy. Its irreverent take on the Wild West and the military made it a trailblazer in the genre, and its influence can be seen in subsequent TV comedies. F Troop remains a cult classic that continues to entertain audiences with its timeless humor. Melody Patterson was only 16 when she auditioned for the 1965 TV series F Troop. She didn't expect to get cast. When she found out that she got the part, she and her mother didn't reveal her real age until just before shooting started. This surprising fact about Melody Patterson's age during the auditions adds an interesting twist to the history of the show, as she played a significant role in F Troop. Patterson's youth at the time was not widely known, and it's a testament to her talent that she secured a role in the series, which is still remembered by fans today. F Troop, Larry Storch, the last survivor on April 7, 2021, the entertainment world mourned the passing of James Hampton, marking a significant moment in the history of the 1965 TV series F Troop. With his death, Larry Storch, another member of the show's cast, became the last surviving actor from the series, an iconic piece of television history. Unfortunately, Larry Storch's time as the last surviving member was short-lived as he too passed away on July 8, 2022. F Troop, a popular sitcom that aired in the mid-1960s, was a Western comedy set at Fort Courage. The show was known for its humor and unique take on the American frontier. It featured a quirky mix of characters, including Larry Storch's Corporal Agarn, who played a prominent role in the series. The passing of the last surviving cast member, Larry Storch, marked the end of an era for F Troop fans. The show's humor and memorable characters continue to have a special place in the hearts of many, even decades after it first aired. In conclusion, the 1965 TV series F Troop had a significant chapter close with the passing of James Hampton and, later, Larry Storch, leaving behind a legacy of laughter and fond memories for its viewers. Old Charlie the Town Drunk was portrayed by Harvey Perry who was 65 years old at the time and had been a stuntman for almost 45 years. He would often be thrown through the saloon doors, bouncing off a support post, falling face forward over the hitching rail, spinning around, and landing on his face or back. Many viewers thought he was a young stuntman in old man makeup. This fact sheds light on the surprising skills of a seasoned performer on the 1965 TV series F Troop, adding an interesting layer to the show's production. 
1965 TV series F Troop was a comedy set in the Old West. It ran for two seasons and drew decent ratings. However, the production company decided to end the show, feeling it wasn't worth the space it took up on the Warner Bros. backlot. One memorable aspect of the show was the character's chief wild eagle, and the Hekas often referred to Captain Wilton Parmenter as the Great White Pigeon. At other times, they called him the Scourge of the West or Mr. Nice Guy. Stars Forrest Tucker and Larry Storch, who played key roles in F Troop, later worked together in the Ghostbusters series that predated the famous films. They also appeared in a TV movie adaptation of The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn and on segments of Love American Style and Grizzly Adams. F Troop may have had a relatively short run, but it left its mark on the world of classic TV comedy, offering a humorous take on life in the Old West. Fame's Dark Side, the struggles of F Troop's cast member in the wake of Hollywood stardom. The TV series F Troop, which aired in 1965, brought fame to its cast members. However, the bright lights of Hollywood stardom also cast shadows on the lives of some of the show's actors. In the wake of their fame, they faced various struggles that often remained hidden from the public eye. This article delves into the challenges that F Troop's cast members encountered in the aftermath of their time in the spotlight, shedding light on the darker side of fame. Some cast members found it difficult to transition to new roles after the show ended, as they became typecast due to their F Troop characters. Others faced personal difficulties in their lives, from financial woes to substance abuse problems. The pressures of fame and the constant scrutiny of the public eye took a toll on their mental and emotional well-being. The legacy of F Troop is a mixed one with moments of fame and success intertwined with the struggles that some of its cast members faced. This article explores the less glamorous side of Hollywood stardom and how it affected the lives of those involved with the show. When co-stars can't coexist, the turbulent relationships among F Troop's cast members the 1965 TV series F Troop had its share of off-screen drama. Behind the scenes, some cast members struggled to get along due to personal differences. These conflicts occasionally spilled over into their on-screen performances. Larry Storch and Forrest Tucker, who played Corporal Agar and Sergeant O'Rourke, had a strained relationship offset. Their differing personalities and professional disagreements created tension. While they managed to maintain their on-screen chemistry, it wasn't always smooth sailing behind the scenes. Ken Berry, who joined the cast in the second season, faced challenges working with the existing ensemble. Adjusting to a new dynamic can be tough, and Berry had to find his place within the established team. Despite these off-screen clashes, F Troop managed to deliver humor and entertainment to its audience. The cast's ability to set aside their personal differences and perform professionally is a testament to their skill and dedication to the show. In the end, while there may have been turbulent relationships among the cast members, they still came together to create a beloved and memorable TV series that continues to be enjoyed by fans. As we bid farewell to our journey through the whimsical world of the 1965 TV series, F Troop, we're left with more than just memories of a bygone era. We're gifted with a tapestry of laughter, camaraderie, and timeless humor that continues to resonate with audiences across the ages. F Troop was more than just a show, it was an invitation to embark on a whimsical adventure, exploring the misadventures of the Hikawi tribe and Fort Courage. It prompted us to laugh at the absurdities of life, to cherish the bonds of friendship, and to revel in the sheer absurdity of it all. Now, it's your turn to join the conversation. What's your personal connection to F Troop? Were you a loyal fan from the start, or did you discover it later in life? Share your favorite moments, your most cherished characters, or the episodes that left you in stitches. Perhaps you've drawn inspiration from the quirky characters, or maybe F Troop holds a special place in your heart as a part of your family's entertainment history. This is your chance to relive those hilarious moments and rekindle your connection to a show that has stood the test of time. So, whether you're reminiscing about the zany antics of Captain Parmenter, the wisdom of Chief Wild Eagle, or the endless schemes of Sergeant O'Rourke and Corporal Agard, we want to hear it all. Your thoughts and memories about F Troop are the final strokes that complete the vibrant canvas of this classic series. Share your experiences, laughter, and nostalgia with us, and let's celebrate the enduring legacy of this timeless show together.
Thank you for taking this trip down memory lane with us and for sharing your reflections on F Troop. Your presence and participation make this journey all the more special. Until we meet again for more nostalgic adventures, this is your invitation to continue celebrating the magic of F Troop.